My name is Angel Portman. I am the CEO of Breckenridge Health Incorporated. The very first day that I was here, when I walked away at the end of the day, the overwhelming impression I had that these were some of the nicest, most welcoming and, and generous people that I'd ever met. And I can tell you that after 11 years, that first impression was correct. Hi, I'm Stacy Butler. I'm the discharge planner and swing bed um, admissions here at Breckenridge Hill. I'm Jill Jaggers. I am a nurse practitioner for McDaniel's Family Care Clinic. My name is Dr. Brian O'Donohue. I am a family physician here in Hardinsburg, Kentucky at Breckenridge Memorial. The thing that has always appealed to me about Breck has been the fact that they are very uh, family oriented. You don't feel like you're just a number here. Everybody works together. So the physicians, I can talk to them every day. Um, whenever I need to, we talk about patient care. They're just very, very accessible. And, and that makes it really nice. I actually started here as the director of Med Surge and moved from that to the quality department. And then while I was in the quality department, um, I went back to school and um, got a dual master's in nursing education and also went ahead and did my post, uh, post master's degree in nurse practitioner. Um, I tested and have now been a nurse practitioner for the facility for just a little over a year. Lots of places you wouldn't have been able to continue to do full-time work and go on to pursue a master's degree or anything like that because it requires a lot of clinical time and a lot of work. Um, but here, they were very encouraging uh, and supportive of my decision to go on and pursue further schooling. Our board is made up of local board members who are our patients. Um, we hear straight from them, you know, how well we're doing in certain areas or if there are things that we need to work on or improve. Um, when I get those kinds of messages from, from board members, from community members, from my staff, um, the process here is that I go and work with the medical staff. Uh, we get their input on, on all new services. And your opportunities to see things, to learn things, to be able to handle things as, as a physician in a rural community, in my opinion, is second to none. This hospital improves and, and saves the lives of the, the people who live in this area every single day. I'm grateful for the opportunity to do this work because this is work that matters. Our community, they play a huge part in, in the hospital and supporting us. They support the patients, they support the staff. Physicians here have opportunities to be involved in lots of things outside the hospital in the things that are available around here. Born and raised in a small town, and I wanted nothing more than to raise my family and work in a small town. If you're a person who wants to be grounded and wants to have that good family security, wants to work in an environment where you know that you're not just a number, that you're a person with, um, with feelings and with family. Working as a nurse, you know, there's days that you just, you're so busy, you go through the day and you wonder if you've made a difference in the patient's lives. Um, and then, you know, patients or family members tell you um, how thankful that they were that we could get them here. Gratitude and appreciation for what we do is overwhelming. If what you're looking for is a place where you can um, be a part of the decision making, uh, be a part of strategic planning to go forward for, for this small hospital that is so important to the community, this is, this is a great place to start. If you're considering um, a, a practice or um, an employment opportunity, we'd love to have you come visit. Well, I have no doubt that we here at Breckenridge Memorial Hospital would love to have an eager young physician to come and join us. We can't wait to have you join our team here at Breckenridge Health.